Even Bonchan, he uses Sagat sparingly. So we'll see. So we don't get to see these. These are good matchups that we don't normally get to see, which was pretty much the theme of this UFN. So it's good to see it in action and seeing these matchups we don't really get to see too much. All right. And let's go. We got Hamad going up against Magnegro. Birdie versus Sagat. Now, there might be some early on sinking, as usual. Shout out to CFN. That man, that man owns a tiger. Fight. Okay. And it looks like, from what I can tell from that sinking, Hamad has been doing a good job of keeping him zoned out. Nice damn mm. roundhouse. Ooh, this. The screen shake. Okay. Man grab. Yes. Okay. Activation. Smart be reversal. Okay, nice sweep. Oh, he catches him. He actually yeah. went. Yeah, he, that was dope. He went for dolphin right there. Yeah. yeah. Dolphin. Okay, nice space tiger knee. This this safe on block. Okay. Mm. Oh, okay. And I think he went for a fierce DP right there when I traded, but nice forward roundhouse to get the anti air. And Hamad doing an amazing job already zoning out Birdie. I feel like this is going to be the answer. He, I think Birdie's jump is so floaty. The guy has a lot of options to punish it. So I think as long as he wins on the ground, he's going to be good here. Mm -hmm. All right, man. He grabs him. And Connor goes for the command grab. Those command grabs are way have way more recovery now, so he actually got a nice little punish off of there. Okay, Activates the yep. standing medium kick. Okay, gets it. Yeah, okay. Doesn't do as much damage because he did get through the block. Okay, nice command grab. Oh, wakes up with it. Has a corner pressure. Ooh. Oh! And he the king. And he gets and he pays off. Okay, but now it's Magnigo's turn. Okay, and he just backs off. Yeah, Pamai wants the space. It's like I got the resources. I got the resources. Ooh. Oh! The reactions on this man. Okay. Oh, nice. Catches him trying to go for the slide. I like the idea if he would have did it a little bit quicker if he had more time. He probably would have got Sagat under that low tiger wins. shot. But it just doesn't pay off in Hamad. Stay solid and keep, keep, you know, keeps his composure and takes that first game. Good stuff. What's up to Hamad? I like what I saw. He bought it. Okay. And that looks like Magnigo is sticking it out with Birdie. Okay. Where's the man grab attempt? Didn't have enough time to go for the punish. Okay, nice sweep. Nice hand right house. And this is rough because I feel like the thing with Sagat is you gotta get that you gotta get probably one, maybe two good jump ins around, and he's been shutting it down. Magnegro, once again, even if it's worth the trade, he's not letting Magnegro get in from the air at all. Magnegro does have feature activated. Let's see what he can do with it. Definitely has some resources to make this come back easily. Oh, oh, nice punish. The sweep. That's actually a punish. Yep. That, that lets you know that he's maximum Sagat right now. That is <laughs> maximum Sagat. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. View reversal. Oh, he catches him with the dolphin dive. Ooh, catch him with another command grab. Quick damage. Regular Forward grab. Up. Okay, Magnigo turned up on this corner pressure. Definitely. See what... See what Ahmad has that oh just goes for it. Definitely gets the oh, and yeah. overhead to finish it. And Magnegro just turned up. He was like, you know what? Hold on, bro. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Ooh, oh great. Nice. Yep. Great. Right through the right through the projectile. Oh uh, nice like anti-air. Yep. Yep, definitely. He's not letting he's not letting Ooh, and that was a clean jump and he didn't get it. Okay, nice spaced out tiger knee. Okay, nice space down Tiger Knee. Ooh, Ooh great disrespectful. Great Ooh, nice. And he had enough time to make that count. And Hamad is doing an amazing job. Keeping the boom, keeping the uh, Tiger shots in front of him. Pressing the right buttons at the right moments. Not allowing Magnifico to get anything going. 
this entire no. time. He's not letting him get anything right now. But this is with the crouch yeah. and medium punch. Okay, but this is birdie. Oh, and here we go. What can he do? Now he got a couple of command throws. Oh, and that's going to be critical art. Oh, he is a dead, but his stun is really high. Let's see what he can do with it. Oh, my God. He's just about dead. Okay, nice. Yeah. All right, now Hamad has all the space and all the tools to fight him in the zone. And Magnigo has no meter. This is going to be a tough situation. Okay, he's trying to inch closer. Oh, and nice stand forward from White Tower Hamad. And stays clutch. And see, that was one of those situations where Magnigo took the life lead, but he used all his resources to get to that point, and he ended up getting pushed away. In that situation, it's rough to get through that obstacle course without any means to, to navigate it. And all Hamad did was just stay patient and keep the tiger shots in front of him, and he got the job done. Round one. Magnigo, being a sim player and whatnot, he's yeah. actually hanging around with Birdie. Maybe he, he maybe feels pretty good about the matchup. Right. Let's see. Let's see what. Let's see what he has. And again, and, and you know, some a lot of players do use UFN as a training grounds. So while there's nothing, you know, on the line, this is a great opportunity to get high level practice in yeah. a matchup that you, you know, because you know, in a tournament, you don't get that often. Exactly. Ahmad just has his face in now. I see. It. Seems like. He's cap he's cap he's doing car on everything, so that just increases his anti-air range. Ooh, wakes up with it, and that was a scar tiger uh up the EX. Activation. Okay. This is dangerous. This is dangerous. Oh, there it is. Too. And two stand fours. Two stand fours. Definitely his best neutral button as far as not necessarily damage, but a certain his position. Ooh, big damage. Oh, nice. Good position as well. Okay. And he was, he was going quick. Right, use the view reversal. Very smart. Oh, nice. Gets through the fireball. Okay, gets to the confirm again. Oh, okay. nice. Whip punish. And a command grab. Now, those are the kind of rounds he needs. Quick. Those are the rounds he needs. Final Very round. strong performance. Yep. Fine. He definitely good that run. I think he needs to keep going with that. Maybe get a bullhorn through one projectile and then just go for it. Or this. Scott's already in the corner. One one hit. Oh. Stan and Fierce beating the EX Tiger D. No invulnerable oh, Just like yeah. that. Make him think about it. Okay, the nice. more I think, I think the more success he has with that, the more he's gonna make him think about throwing it. I think Amaz here and Amaz not so quick to throw him because he yep. gotten caught a couple times. Ooh, nice stand roundhouse. Okay, gets the re reversal to get the pressure off him. And now Magnigo has the resources. And then it's Amaz who does it. Okay, he got one meter. Okay, uses his last view reversal. He probably won't get v, uh, v trigger anymore this fight. Oh, and that's good. Okay, and that is going to be death. And Magnigo right now with his decision. He's like, you know what? I'm going to grind this matchup out. I like what he did. He didn't swap. He thought he thought about what was going on and didn't jump ship and made the adjustment. I like that. Okay, so Magnigo puts himself on the board. Hamad still in the lead, 2-1. But this is definitely not going to be a sweep. Think, of, think about, like, the thing I liked um, about what he did there was the bullhorns oh, through the projectiles because that made Hamad push more buttons. That he could whip punish. Exactly. Yep. Okay, nice. Gets the sweep. See how many he throws. See if Magnigo can get through that quick. Oh, he tried it right there. Still got through with a yep. punish. That's, I think that's going to be the determining factor right now. Getting through those and getting the punish. We're still about even right now, though. Both players have been triggered in there. Oh, on cue. Okay, and Hamad uses V reversal, so he loses the ability to V trigger right now. He'll probably get one another one back, depending on how much damage he takes. But it looks like it was a great decision. Oh, oh, oh! And he does have V trigger, and he uses the EXDP. Nice, gets the cancel on the V trigger. Hamad is out of meter. Oh! 
I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. You can't see it. I knew it was coming. You can't see it. I knew that was coming. I knew that was coming. I felt that from the depths of my soul. I'm like, he about to get off and dive. He threw up around and there's a bull horn through the projectile. See if he can tie this up 2 2. Okay, he was out of range for that. Nice back throw from Hamad. Okay, he uses the EX to keep the pressure applied. This is a great spot for him. This oh, is nice. Spot. This is a great spot for him. Gets a character with a floaty jump like that, man. The guy makes his money in the corner. Oh, nice stand, fierce. Oh. And he has that He has that in the, in the tuck now. He yeah. definitely has that in the tuck. There. Enter it. No. Oh, no. Was that a missed input or did he think a tiger shot was coming out? Oh, I'm not sure, but it Oh, still alive. Ah, he probably could have actually got a punish off of that instead of the view versa. Oh, no anti it. That could have been a big one. Okay, now Magnigo does have meter, so he has to be careful. And Hamad does not have any more EX bar. This is dangerous. Oh, great. Oh, man, that was a great one. Oh! And another one returned. And a whiff stand of Roundhouse leads to a win. face check from Magnigo with the stand fierce, and he ties things up 2-2. Two, two. That was impressive for my counter then with that crouching medium. He caught that. He caught that sliding. Caught Birdie slide with the crouching medium punch. Magnigo answered quickly, punishing Round the standing one. Roundhouse with a standing fierce. Fight. <laughs> I feel like Hamad is throwing so many less tiger shots now. Right. Okay, now nice he's changing the matchup. Great nice anti. anti yeah, yeah. Great nice anti. anti yeah. And Hamad just playing patient. Yep. He's using less. He's using less tiger shots. I think Ooh. he realized. Nice and that was after a nice tiger knee over the can to navigate that. Magnigo catches him. But he gets him back out, so he's back in safe territory. Oh, nice back throw from Magnigo. MV trigger, let's see what he can do here. Great anti air. And a command grab. Oh, that is the round. And it looks like emotion. Momentum have completely shifted. Right now, Magnigo poised to take the lead if he can keep us up. Three games in a row? Yeah, looks like Hamas. Hamas definitely using his Tiger shots. Few and far between now. And it seems like Magnigo's taking advantage of that. He's able to navigate that space because if you think about it, in the neutral, especially on the ground, uh, Sagat so has standing medium kick. Probably his best, but, but other than that, you can kind of walk into him and challenge him some, some of them, but that, yep. Magnigro is fully stocked. This might be our next. His next hit might kill. Right? And I know I know Hamad is aware of that, so he has to be careful. He has to be. He has to be super careful here. Okay. Get the activation. Oh, no. Magnigro's after. He wants any hit here. Any hit here ends this. Hamad has to be extremely careful. Yep. Oh, he's doing a good job oh, keeping those tiger oh, shots. Oh, Ooh. He has to be careful. Oh, Ooh. walks into another one. Now, I feel like Manigo was trying to buffer to critical I think he was waiting for shot. something. I think he was waiting for something specifically and yep. kind of got away from the game plan. Okay, nice crush counter sweep. Okay, gets the EX confirmed into the corner. Ah, command it's grab. He's done. Quick. Quick. Oh, is that stun? That's stun. Uh oh. Hey, damn it. Quick. Let's not play these. Let's not play these pussies games. Let's just end the round. Oh okay. my God! What is? Let's, let's just end the round. He's already dead. Please. That, that man has a cleaver on his waist. Oh wow. And Mag Negro just completely terrorized him in the corner. Let, let Let's not play neutral. Let's just get this over with. And those are the rough situations because you want you don't want to use meter and guess wrong and then lose all your life. But then you try to challenge with a button and it just doesn't work out. Yep. He had all the answers right there. Pretty much steamrolled that round. Three games in a row. Let's see if Ahmad has an answer. Magnigo's kind of settled in here. Oh, with it though. Forward door. 
I think he's gonna have to throw them tiger shots just from a certain range. He needs to find he needs to find that range where he can't get punished. And I think he'll be alright. Oh, oh wow. Goodness. He gets to hit again. Oh, he tries to anti air that. Oh, Fortunate for Hamad, yep, and gets out of the corner. Big damage. Again. I love doing that. Okay, nice EX. He's not in a rush to activate either, just in case he needs V reversal. He could have activated. And there it is, right on cue. That's why you don't activate too early, right there. He got himself out of the situation quickly. All right, nice stand forward. Keeps him at bay. And Hamad is taking a very patient approach to this matchup and kind of slowing things down because he kind of got into a, a brawl with Magnigo, and that's when Magnigo started to take off. I think, yep. The longer the match, the longer the match, the more successful for Hamad. The quicker the match, right. man, look, damage and damage over and over. Right oh, big damage. Missed it. Okay. Hamad with an answer. Tiger Knee gets him out the corner. Let's see what he has here. Now, normally he's been saving his V reverse, his V trigger for V reversals. I think Ooh. he may have to pop it here, but Magnigo's trying to end this quick. Oh, oh nice. No. And he didn't want to commit to using the meter because there's another round to go. And Magnigo. Turning things around, like he, it's like he, the first two games was information and then he's just been on attack ever since. It clicked. Since. It clicked. It clicked. I like his use to Tiger Knee, but he hasn't had much success with it. As far as trying to get what he's looking for there. There it is again. I think that was when he had his most, he had a mix of, he had a mix of decent Tiger shots and he kept him up. Kept him out the air, just like that, over and over, to where he was trying to react to something. But you can't do that there. That was what Roundhouse Tiger needs. He would punish. Magneto was fully stopped with the V-Trigger. Dangerous. I like that space in the mods that probably yeah. three, three, four screen. He can tag a shot almost freely. Yep. And again, Negro the, again, as indicated, you know, as stated earlier, the longer the round, the better things work out for Hamad. Yep. And it's just a matter of keeping him in bank. Oh, oh, oh he, he misses. misses. Oh, no, 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 no. Not like this. Not like this. Not like this. Not like oh, this. no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. No. Okay. He okay. tried to anti-air it too, but Sagat's jump back fierce. Sagat would actually beat him. He tried too. Yeah, he, uh, he tried. Went, he, went, he went for crouching. I believe it. Yeah, that, that was crouching fierce. He went for the crouching fierce. I wonder if he would have went for uh, crouching medium punch, would he have gotten that instead? Now, I think he missed his Kara. I, I don't think the Kara step came out, so that's why it didn't work. Okay. Round one. All right, we are all tied up. 3 3. Again, this is a brawl. Great match so far. Now, I don't know if there's enough uh, recovery on that block sweep for him to kind of DP punch that on block. I know he can against some characters, but I know Bernie's one of them. I think it depends on the range. It definitely depends on the range. If he spaces it well, I don't think he can punish it. Ooh, nice anti-air again. Man, he's just keeping it very patient. Ooh, nice. Okay, it looks like he tried to dive over that fireball. Okay, gets the V-Trigger activation. Oh, and that goes to the fireball, and the can is still going. Oh, Again. Here comes the can. Mmm, okay. he triggers them all. I love, I love the view reverse. I love the view reverse yep. decisions that he makes. Constantly gets him out of situations, as opposed to using it for a V trigger. Magnigo still in the position with Hamal with him back to the corner. To try and make something happen, that V trigger is running out quickly, though. Yep. Oh, gets the hit. Okay. Oh, oh no. no! And then, he made it happen. Yeah. Right there. He definitely, definitely made that happen. Man grab all your life. I'll take it. Man, you go with the first round answer to Hamad's last game. All right, keeping that bang. Hamad trying to keep bunching from him. Oh, and there there go. Go. His, oh. His answer and then another answer. Amazing. Right. Ah, yeah. out of range. Ah, but a drop combo, but he gets to pick up anyways. Alright, I'm gonna need to turn there. Hamad wanted his respect, though. Right now, Hamad does have V-Trigger, don't you? He hasn't really been able to get much going off of that this entire set. 
So let's see I if they can use that for a comeback mechanic right yeah, now. Yeah, I think this is a situation where you don't want to use it for beer reversal just because you don't have any anything else. And there it is on activation. Same turn. Both activate. Oh, on the break. I think he's willing to take that. Yep. You get it. You get so much of that meter off of him for minimal damage. I think that was good. Same thing here. Okay. Now, now they're about even. And Magnero is actually in V trigger. Gold have a bar. Yep. All right. And oh, and that's gonna kill. And Magnero takes the game, going up four three over Hermod. He's now one game away from taking his set. This Man, has been a fight. great back and forth. They fighting. They're fighting. They're like fighting, this. fighting. They're Nobody, fighting, yeah. nobody's, nobody's trying to go home quick. Not at all. If you're going to win, you're going to win at the end. And see, that's the perk, actually, of having events like this. Because, Round you know, one. when you got to go home, you already home. Right. Like, you just you gotta, are, you are, you already there, man. You just got to turn off the PlayStation and lay down. That's the range right there. See that when he went to the board? I think that's the range my wants to be at. That's the that's the Hamada. Hamada wakes up with DP. He wants that respect. Activation. Now he immediately activated there. I like that. I think he saw that he actually got he got hits last time. Yep. Let it go. Let it go. Yep. And then he probably could have used me to close that out, but he's probably holding on to it. Mm, forward yep. medium kick. Caught him with the low. Watch your feet. Yep. Round two. I like I like that. I think he realized that. In that last game, even though he didn't win it, he had some success using his V his V meter aggressively. Yep. Let's see if he keeps doing that. Oh, nice crouch around house. Okay, gets the meaty overhead. And Magneto trying to close this out now. Ooh, nice Ooh, hand fierce. Stuffs, it. Stuffs the tiger shot right there. Okay, nice Again, ball. Huh? Range on that, man. Oh, oh, nice whip punish. There you go. Okay, Hamad still fighting. Mm, and that's going to be death. And we are on match point. Mag Negro's one round away from taking this set. Let's see if Hamad can keep things going. Come on. Go, Saget. Oh, oh no anti yep. right there. That's oh, not good. Yep. That's not good. It's not a good sign. Okay. Not a good sign to start. Oh. Mm, Mag Negro, he's in his own. He, he has a spot. He knows exactly where he wants to be the punish at at this point. Look at him just staying there. Nice anti-air though. Oh, look, it's, he's just at the perfect range. Anything yep. Hamad does gets punished. If it's a projectile, it's bullhorn. If he pulls out a normal, he's stuffing it with the standard medium. Right, nice. He's catching him with the EX knee. Nice anti-air. Hamad keeping the things going. Yeah, I feel like there's another bullhorn coming up. That might have been it right yep. there. They actually got stuff. Oh, oh no. input With error. Input. Oh, and Hamad. Hamad is like, nah, it ain't over. The king. It ain't over. The king. 4-4. Four, four. They want it. Yeah, they want they it. They both want it. They want this win. This is what I'm talking about, baby. This is what I like to see. I like to see a fight. Man. And they are this at it. Good. All right. Last game. This is for all the Coronas. I know that's not the, how you say it, but mm -hmm. that's what we're going with. Right. Oh, big damage. Already getting Hamad back to the corner. This ain't good for Hamad. Another sweep. Okay. Yeah. Oh, nice walk back right there. Okay. Great with punish. Okay. Don't reach. Yep, nice sweep. Okay, he couldn't punish that. that sweep a lot. He that sweep a lot. No punish for it. Yep, but then he just backs up slowly. And he's being a little bit less predictable with his projectile ranges. Man. Oh, nice grab. grab. Okay. Activation. Okay. Oh, oh, good aim. I like that. Yep. He knew that he he knew that he was gonna go for the punish. Oh, and that's gonna hurt. Oh no, he drops it. Another drop, drop from Magnegro. And not like that. And Hamad's on match point. Point. Quick with it. This is it. Let's let's see what Mag Magnegro is doing. Oh, oh great. Nice. I like that. Yep. Gets the back throw. That's the I'm a block, but I'm gonna throw it at the same time. Mm. Okay, big damage. Good he has to set up. Yep. Keeps him in range. Okay, and again, Hamad has just changed up the pace of his buttons and what he's doing, and it's been doing a great job. Has him here in the corner. Gets out the corner. No punish. 
Oh, nice anti air. Hamaz, Hamaz walking forward a lot. He wants this over with. Yep. Activation. The reversal. Yeah, he wants this over with. I think he realizes. Mixing up his ranges there. Oh, nice. Yeah, see, he mix it up. Man, man, Nico's about to pull something off. He's already activated. And that's, yep, and that's it. it. And White Tower Hamad takes it over Sagat Magnegro. 5-4 with Sagat. To the people like, oh, Sagat trash in chat. Sagat just got the W. The W. He getting buckets. Did he have to work hard? Yeah.